what's your favourite Ashes memory? Um, I think my first Ashes memory has to be in 2005, I think, when um, we won it for the, the same year the men did and obviously we got the open uh, bus um, ride around London, so that was pretty special. Who is uh, the most feared opponent in the uh, Australian squad? Um, I think they've obviously got world-class players in their team, so um, I think as a unit they're very threatening and I think obviously they've got some good individual players as well. I think um, Meg Lanning certainly sort of stepped up to the role as captain, so um, yeah, I think as a team they're a very strong uh, unit and obviously we're, we're making sure that we're as prepared as possible. What are you most looking forward to for this Ashes summer? Um, I think just the opportunity to play at some of the grounds that we're playing at. Obviously we're here at Bristol today and, and we've got a big game here on the 23rd of July and that's something that a lot of the girls who haven't played um, here before are really excited about and obviously the crowds that we're getting now are, are obviously increasing and, and that's something that we're all really looking forward to. So obviously the men's ashes are here. Uh, I'm not going to ask you about the women's ashes because, you know, that's you know up to us. But, uh, you know, men's ashes prediction, what do you think the scoreline will be? Um, oh, I couldn't say a scoreline, but obviously I hope that England win.